when I graduated in 1961, with the exception of a white home, which is now the admissions office, there was one building on this campus. And when I see what it has become, tremendous sense of pride. And knowing the administration here, as I do, I'm certain that we're on the right path to even greater things. What I like to share with that pride is that the university offered me something that none of the other universities would. University of Hartford said, we will take your associate's degree and we will help you build on that. And that's what they did. Had it not been for my degree from here, I would never have become the director of radiology at Hartford Hospital. And I had all the skills from here to make it a successful career for me. I was able to talk to my professors after class, before class, they were always available. I knew some of the staff, I knew some of the administration, and they helped me adjust to being 10 years older than my classmates. Had it not been for their understanding of my particular problem, of being an older student, I don't think I would have made it. And how can I not support a university that was that good to me? I believe supporting the University of Hartford is so students can have the opportunity to obtain a degree from the same institution that I did. Not every student that comes here has the financial support from their families. And by me giving back, it's paying it forward so others can have that same opportunity. None of us really like to think of it, but we don't stay on this earth forever. And whether you are a religious person or not, my philosophy there is that when the last person who knows you dies, in effect, you have died. Because there's no memory of you on this earth any longer. So when you do these things, you pay forward. And your name is on the scholarship, uh, on the locker in the baseball locker room. So, though I am gone, and I'm sure people will say, who in the world was Bernie Rosen? But my name will be mentioned. So we do pay forward, and in our own little way, uh, we give ourselves a little immortality. <laughs>